and welcome back to Calvert Creations and a very weird video. Uh, this is not the content I had planned to release this week but we have an emergency situation in our family and I don't know how that's gonna affect um, my content moving forward but I wanted to keep you in the loop and not just disappear off the face of the earth. So yesterday our beloved border collie link he he hurt his back real bad and he's paralyzed in his hind legs and um, he's currently in the ICU uh, getting massive amounts of painkillers and he's stressed out and he's in a lot of pain and he can't walk and we're waiting for um, I think it's called an MRI um, I haven't scripted this as you might tell, so I don't know how cohesive I'm gonna be. Um, this also brings back all of the memories from when our staffy had a back injury and was paralyzed in her hind legs. So, to be honest, I'm not really... My hopes are not very high. Um, I love that dog so much. So yeah, uh, I still have a bunch of scheduled content to go up on Patreon, so that won't be affected in case I just can't deal with this aspect of my work. Um, sorry for the heat pump, I'm not gonna stop this recording, you're just gonna have to do with... have to deal with it. Um, yeah, so I have uh, content that's going up on Patreon that's already recorded. I do have some content I can edit when I feel like it and post on YouTube as well. So in case you wonder why I'm all happy and chirpy in some videos and then I might be very low-key <laughs> sad uh, with low energy. I don't know. The thing is, I I want to keep the ball rolling. I don't want to hide under a pile of leaf and wait for spring to roll around. I We just lost our other dog this summer and Link is only seven years old and um, I'm not ready to let go of him but also he is a very sensitive soul and he's very easily stressed and I don't think he could manage months upon months with rehabilitation um, in case that's even an option. Um, so yeah, currently I'm just waiting for the animal hospital, the veterinarian, to call me back and tell me if they've seen anything in the, um, in the x-rays, in the MRI. She had a theory that it might be something that's been dormant, like perhaps a tumor or something uh, lying next to the spine or the nerve canals. And this accident um, made it bloom out. So yeah. So what happened was that um, Alex was going in the car with... Um, he was gonna take Linus to karate and he was gonna go for a walk with Link during the time Linus was at his practice um, so he opened up the the back of the car and he saw that the kids uh, kick bikes were laying on the floor there so he told Link to wait and not to jump in because he would jump in straight on, upon those kick bikes but Link was already mentally prepared for the jump so when he said, said stop Link jumped but kind of inhibited himself so he did a bad jump and crashed right into the the edge of the car um, so he hit the area between the throat and the legs um, boog in Swedish um, <coughs> so yeah then he, he was paralyzed in his leg in his hind legs and he pooped himself and everything so it was awful um, yeah so that's what's going on right now and fingers crossed everything 
will magically sort themselves out. Um, worst case scenario, I will lose this dog as well. Thank you so much for watching this little time lapse. This was some footage I had from way back many years ago when I was drawing Link. I uh, thought it would be <laughs> suitable to use as a little update on this very sad note. Thank you so much for watching. Have a lovely day. Hey, everyone.